When, tell us a little bit about, do you remember anything from it? And uh, and what was it like immediately after? Did you think you could go back in, just couldn't? Uh, well, I just remember I was coming across the, the line and we just hit, hit heads out. And then uh, now I tried to you know uh, get back and play D, but like it was just, everything was just a blur. So uh, when I had got to stop on defense, I, I had to come out. and. Uh, I went to the back and just I had a headache, sharp pain. So uh, then the manager told me I uh, wasn't able to return. So. How was it sitting on the bench watching the games go on? Like at any point, did you just want to jump up and go check yourself in, but realize that you weren't cleared to play? Uh, I mean, I, while I was on the bench, I just tried to bring as much energy, you know, to my teammates, you know, uplift them, you know, cheering them on. You know, some of the guys that may not have played as much when I was playing, they had the opportunity. So uh, I was just trying to encourage them, you know, just don't worry about, you know, playing or trying to do anything, just play basketball. Last week, Coach was uh, telling us that while you were uh, like in practice, you were standing there next to him. It was like, you, oh, so now you see what we're saying. Mm -hmm. So, like, what did you pick up anything from watching instead of being in there that you would take back with you when you hit the court? Yeah, I learned, uh, just watching, you know, uh, being on the on the sideline, you know, some of the plays, you know, like little moves that uh, I could find to uh, give me some scoring opportunities and uh, helping my teammates get in scoring opportunities. So uh, I just took that time, you know, just to evaluate the offense and stuff and defense to uh, become a better player. Going forward, how important is kind of the assist to turnover ratio? You guys have had a lot of games where you had more turnovers than assists. Uh, just taking care of the ball is just something I think we just need to do. Uh, I think if we take care of the ball, we'll, we'll win a lot of games. You eager to get into conference play too? I mean, you guys have maybe done better than people thought you were going to do and kind of show that you know you can be competitive? Yeah, we're ready to get into conference play, but I don't think we're too worried about what everybody else has to say about you know, us. Uh, we're just every day here trying to grind and get better. Is this the first time you ever had a concussion? No, I had uh, two concussions in high school mm -hmm. playing football. You've been experiencing the same type of situation more, or was this worse than the last one? Uh, it was about the same. What, did, what position did you play, and how long did it take you before you could get back on the field? Uh, I played quarterback and wide receiver. And it was like, I missed like two, two three games. Mm -hmm. Does that, was, it, was that your reason to get out of football and go basketball? Yeah, it was my reason. <laughs> reason football. <laughs> You know, Quavo from the Migos was a quarterback in high school, too. You think yeah. he was a better quarterback than him? I did. <laughs> uh, Jamario, uh, Keith has been really uh, the primary one vocal about this, but are you saying that you guys sometimes play down to some teams that aren't really the name brand teams out there? You have one in LSU, but have you noticed that throughout the course of the year? Uh, I don't really know what a name brand team is, you know what I'm saying, but uh, I mean, <laughs> I feel like we sometimes do play down to the level of our competition. You know, uh, I mean, it's just the habits that, you know, that are in some players, you know, they watch film and think, oh, this guy may not be that good. But everyone, once they come into the field, it's for them. They're going to try to give us their best shot. So uh, no matter who the team is, uh, I'm going to come out and try to give them all. Do y'all judge the level of competition by what you see on the film or by the record coming into the game? Uh, I don't judge it, but I don't, I don't look at no, nobody as a, you know, I, I feel like you can be B at any given day. Uh -huh. I take all my opponents serious. Uh -huh. So, uh, you know, me, I just, I just come ready to play. Uh -huh. It's serious every guy. What do you see out of LSU? What sort of challenge will this be for you guys tomorrow? It's a lot of length, you know, athleticism in the inside. Uh, like, they like to uh, play defense, you know, a lot of defenses. So I think there's something uh, we'll, we'll have to adjust to. Do you guys still feel like you're having you know, proven yourself still of what you are and what you can be? Uh, you're I feel like you've sort of shown here in these first 12 games like this is who we are. I mean, we 
just playing basketball, just trying to get a W. So, I mean, how big come, that's, that's how we're going to take in the road. Nice did, one. Did you get an Apple Watch for Christmas, too? No, I've been had Apple Watch. <laughs> 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 uh, Thank you.